Hey guys, this is Linda Miner, and I decided that I would just make a quick video on uh, how this new Turnant uh, Take Payment system is going to work just so that I could share the information as quickly as possible. So basically, we have got a partnership with Take Payments, which is one of the largest payment companies in Canada. They do about $2 billion uh, a month at this point, uh, which is huge. And the lady who started the company actually uh, started out in the UK. That's where she had her first business uh, with this type of uh, company. And she took over one third of the UK market um, during her time there and uh, now she has brought this business over to Canada. So uh, just uh, a fantastic uh, person in charge of this program and she's already proven herself with the business that she's done before. So uh, let's jump right into this. So here's the brochure that we can actually take with us and hand out to merchants and this is what we can say to them that if we cannot lower your credit card processing costs based on what you've done for the last 12 months um, you're going to receive $5,000. And so there's no ifs, ands, or buts about that. If we can't show them a way to save money, I even asked the question during the Q&A period. I said, what if someone says they're on a contract and there's going to be a cancellation fee attached to that contract if they try to get out of it with Moneris or one of those other companies? And what we were told was that we are to say to them, if you're on a contract and you have a cancellation fee, we will work that into, um, you know, lowering your, your cost. And if we can't prove to you that you can save enough to justify that cancellation fee, then you get $5,000. So there's really no reason why they want, wouldn't want to look at getting a quote. All you're going to do is just try to get a quote and we can do it directly from our phone, from the phone app which is up for an award through the Direct Selling Association because it seems to be the best app on the market right now. Uh, through our app, we can go ahead and we just put, it's a really simple information, basically their name, phone number, email address, best time to reach them, uh, what their average uh, monthly uh, billing is or processing uh, costs are, um, and uh, who they're dealing with right now. And then they will get a call from an agent. I believe there's 70 or 75 agents ready to talk to them. And they will, the agent will close them. You don't have to worry about closing them. The agent will do that. And you can see here, they won't be on a contract. There's no cancellation fees, no admin fees, no setup fees, no annual fees. So right there, they're going to save a ton of money. But we can offer the lowest rates on Visa, MasterCard, Amex, Discover, and um, debit. And not only that, we can offer gateway fees for people who are e-commerce merchants. So people who uh, maybe are using um, the uh, iSquare right now for their uh, with their iPhone to pay that way. Those fees are brutal on those. And so even for businesses like that, where maybe they uh, maybe they do the the trade shows uh, or you know the the mar summer markets and um, or, or even the vendors who are you know doing the hot dog stands who are just using uh, their um, iPhone or iPay for, for that. In fact, we're going to be connected with Apple Pay with this as well. Um, so we can offer those merchants a, a huge discount on what they're paying right now. Also, that we can offer a cash advance of up to $300,000 for a business. Now, a lot of businesses are not showing income yet. And if they are making income, they're putting it back into their business. So when they go to the bank and try to get a loan, they get refused. And um, the fellow who gave us the presentation told us about one guy who was, uh, you know, he wanted a $44,000 loan for his uh, chick, chip truck and went to the bank. They wouldn't uh, give him the money. He went to one of those, you know, loan companies that, you know, charge you an arm and a leg. Uh, they wouldn't even give it to him, um, but he approached uh, Take Payments and within uh, 24 hours it had been approved and within 72 hours it was in his bank account. And the way that it gets paid back is that instead of paying $500 a month against your loan, uh, what they do is they say, look, we'll just take one of your transactions per day and put that towards your loan. So you don't even feel it. It's a completely painless way to pay back the loan. So one transaction a day, and then uh, that, that goes to paying off your loan. And once it's paid off, it's paid off. So this is very appealing to a lot of businesses because they can't get loans, as I said, from the bank, they're even their own banks where they originally set up with. Um, and then just these are just some more details about what you get with this uh, next day funding. So right away, the cash goes into their bank account. You're not waiting three or four days to receive the money. Also, we offer um, gift cards with this. 
gift cards are a huge attraction for businesses because most gift cards don't get completely spent. So I don't know if you've ever had like a, a Starbucks gift card or, or you know even a spa gift card uh, and you don't use it or it gets lost or you don't use the whole amount. You think, oh, there's $5 left on that. Okay, never mind. Well, that happens a lot. Huge amount of money gets left on gift cards. So vendors really want that and we offer that option to them. So that's really important to focus on. So the three most important things to focus on when we're approaching businesses are the gift cards, the business advances, the cash advances that they can get, and the $5,000 guarantee on their product. So let's just look at how much money that could mean for you. So the first thing we want to do, because this is obviously brand new to Canada, is we want uh, Turnot to get a total of $550 million in processing going through our businesses. Now, surprisingly, that's just about 500 businesses that we need because the average processing per business is a million dollars a year. So if we get approximately 500 businesses, that's going to allow us to reach the maximum residual uh, payout cap. So we still will get residuals uh, up until we achieve that amount, but the residuals will um, max out and we'll get the most bang for our buck, so to speak. So we want to do that as quickly as possible. So once we have achieved that, then if you are going to a business that does a million a year, the residual on that for you would be approximately 220 to $330 per month per merchant. So let's say you go into a little uh, restaurant that's just down the street from you, offer them uh, this business, they or, uh, the sorry, the payment processing, they take it, they do a million a year, you are going to earn from 220 to 330 a month, every month from that business ongoing. As long as they are using your machine, um, you're going to make that money. So just for example's sake, let's assume that it's $200 a month that you make per merchant. So if you were to go to 15 merchants and get them to switch over and the fellow doing the presentation approached a number of merchants to find out um, what they were um, you know, willing to do or not. And hundred percent of them said, yeah, I'll take a look at this. They submitted a quote. They all said yes. And uh, we offer other service of, over and above this as well that can be tied into it, including phone services and internet and etc. But we don't need to talk about that right now. But in fact, all of those businesses were interested in those as well, but just keeping it to the residual for the processing. So if we assume $200 a month for a million dollar annual processing, 15 merchants is going to give you 200 a month per merchant. That's $3,000 a month in residual. Now, if you were to get 100 merchants at 200 a month, that would be $20,000 a month in residual. Now, would that be worth taking five minutes out of your day to walk into a shop? Maybe that you go to regularly, maybe where you get your hair cut, where you get your nails done, where you eat on a regular basis, uh, the coffee shop that you like to hang out at. Now, we're not going to be approaching Tim Hortons or McDonald's or the Gap or any of these big kinds of chains because you know they're dealing uh, with the, the corporate stuff that's a totally different thing but your mom and pop shops the the person who owns the little clothing store even thrift stores uh, they're using merchant processing let's help them save some money there's all kinds of people who own their own business and a hundred or two hundred dollars a month in savings for them could be the difference between staying in business or going out of business so let's support these businesses and help them to have cheaper processing fees. And in the meantime, we can make some money. So I bet right off the top of your head, you can think of 10 or 15 places that you could go to right away and make this offer to. And if you did even visited one a day and, uh, and got those contracts, you would very quickly be making this monthly residual and it would be ongoing as long as those people have that contract and you can approach as many businesses as you want. There's no limit. So even if you have another job, you can do this on your lunch hour or after work or on the weekends or when you go to get that haircut or when you go to get your nails done. And uh, if you have another network marketing business, chances are this will not be a conflict of interest for you. You still will be able to do this. And uh, you can do this during the day while you do your other network marketing business at night. So I'm very excited about this. If you have questions, please let me know. I'll be happy to answer them. I can also talk to you about some of the other um, uh, opportunities to share, to build even more in this uh, residual for yourselves. And this does not include the, the turn on compensation plan. This is just the residual. You'll still make money from the turn on compensation plan over and above this. Just so I want to add that almost forgot. Okay, so send me any questions that you have and uh, I'll be happy to answer them for you.